Yo, what's up, everybody? It's JBAT210, Fuego on that motherfucking hoe. Right here in the Loma side, Loma Park hood. Uh, this is my childhood home right here. And uh, this is where a lot of my music uh, comes from, from this, uh, from this house right here, you know what I'm saying? Uh, a lot of pain, uh, a lot of domestic violence, what I really saw in my life. There would always be cop cars out on the street. There would be about eight cop cars. And uh, people would, uh, people that lived around here that were in my class, they would ask me the next day, hey, uh, what happened at your house yesterday? And I would just tell them not to worry about it and shit like that. But uh, yeah, that's what, uh, some people that know me, that's, that's what was going on. That's what was going on behind the scenes. A lot of broken doors, a lot of uh, holes in the wall, you know what I'm saying? Things like that. Sometimes we didn't have water, sometimes we didn't have light. But uh, that's uh, that's just a small part of my story. That's just how I was raised, and uh, I just want to let you know who I am today with the, with this interview right here. You want to take him in? Huh? Take him inside the house? Yeah, I'm gonna. J Bad Two Ten is the ultimate. He's the best rapper out there. He believes in himself entirely. He's confident. He's the one. He's funny. He's charming. He's everything. He's everything. I am in my dreams. And he's a fucking savage, but nah, he's just a fucking savage. He just wants to rip out everybody's fucking throat. He just wants to be the best rapper he could be at the end of the day. Jacob just wants to be loved. He just wants to be respected. He just wants to be known. He just wants to spread love. But uh, Jacob's, Jacob's too weak inside. He's too insecure. He believes in himself, but he always has that other voice in him just telling him that he can't do it. And that's why I had to create j Bad 210 to kind of put Jacob away because Jacob can't get it done. And j Bad 210 is who San Antonio needs. He's the, he's the savior. He's the one. All right, next one. Fuego sounds real cool on the track, you know what I'm saying? But uh, to me, what it means is the fire in your heart. How bad do you want it? Does it burn inside you every day? Do you feel it every second of the day? Are you always thinking about where you're trying to get? Are you always thinking about your goal? Are you always masterminding? Are you always getting out there and being productive to make sure you get it done? That's what that fuego is, the desire, the fire within. No, that's the best way to put it, the fire within, that is fuego. J Bad 210, nobody can match my flows. I don't, I don't think anybody can really match my versatility as far as the types of songs that I make, I feel like some people can only make, everybody has their cup of coffee or a cup of tea. Some people like this and people like that, but I feel like I can give one to everybody. And I feel like some people can only give one cup of tea. And that's why I think I'm the best. I got so many types of flows. I got, I could rap on almost any type of beat, but uh, just except for lip beats, I don't like lip beats. I don't like to brag and talk about things that I don't have because that's what those types of beat, beats are for, and that's not me. Uh, everything inspires me, really. Uh, everything I've been through growing up, uh, the heartbreak that I felt that really put me back on the music. I wasn't making music for about two years straight, and I just recently came back and started in February uh, recording again, and I already have 27 songs, and it's right now it's August. So uh, that's real badass. I'm still going for my 50 tracks. So That really inspired me. What also inspires me is these other artists and. San Antonio, some people that just want to rap about lollipops and bubble gum and I got this, I fucked your bitch that. That really inspires me. I don't want that to be our, our sound. So that's why I'm really trying to, to switch it up and do all these different types of flows and these different songs. I make music for people with broken hearts. I make music for the kids who didn't get what they wanted for Christmas. I make music for uh, the kids that didn't make that basketball team, they didn't make the A team, but they know they're good enough. I make, I make music for everybody. For people that like to get lit, for people who have problems, for people who've seen some shit, I make music for, for everybody at the end of the day, because anybody can really jam my shit. Even if you're a white boy, you know what I'm saying? You have everything you want, get everything you want for Christmas. You can hear one of my lit songs and you relate to it. For some reason, nobody responds to me when I and ask them to work. Like Eliza 1K, I've asked her numerous times, and uh, I don't know if she won't work with me. I've gone to one of the same studios as her, and I've done, I've done the 27 tracks there this year, and uh, 
I pit her up a lot. I'm always kind of talking like a little bit of smack because I just want better than her because she's so hard. She is so hard, but I feel like she's stuck on the same flow. And I feel like if she were to work with me, she could just take it to a whole new level of creativity that I could take her to. But uh, if she doesn't want to do that, that's cool. I'm all right with that. And um, I've hit up so many people, you know what I'm saying, been left on red so many times. And, uh, you know, I'm just tired of it. Like, I make, I make the music best by myself. I don't really get stuck anymore and say, well, I can't, uh, I'm stuck, I have block. I can't finish that song. Uh, let me see if I can get somebody to hop on it. And um, I also just wanna, at the end of the day, I wanna say I did it by myself. Cause I've seen people like Blake and Mateo Son and they, uh, they do features with every and anybody. I don't wanna do features with every and anybody. I just wanna work with the best and uh, at the end of the day, that's why I work with myself. But uh, if I've ever hit you up to work, I really think you, you're talented and I'd love to work with you. They always refer to this city as a crab in a bucket. One crab gets out the bucket, every other crab is trying to pull him back in. And I really, I really think that's how it is. Because you see the way Blake uh, left to Los Angeles, everybody loved him, everybody loved him. This city was his, this was his city. It was his, no one could question it, nobody. But, uh, you know, I've heard some things kept happening that they were confronting him in his face and he wasn't doing anything about it. I wish somebody would come and confront me. I would get my ass beat on camera right then and there. You know, I'm not going to run away. You got something to say to me, come say it to me. But at the end of the day, you know what? If I say something about you and your manhood, you can come at me and fight. You know what I'm saying? I'll fight back. But if I say something about you as an artist, as a rapper, you can come rap at him. And if you don't want to rap out of me, you're not a true MC. And you have nothing for the game. And you got put it in your heart. You ain't bought it. You got bitch in your blood. But that's, that's how I would do it. I would never run away. I love this city with all my heart. But people, go, people get a little bit of uh, success and uh, they get comfortable. That's why I keep on making songs. I don't want none of my songs to blow up and I get comfortable. I have so many songs I think already out that I think are major hits. And I'm not promoting them because I don't want to get comfortable. I want to make my 50 songs for the year and then chill. And then I'm going to promote this fit, the shit out of those 50 songs and I'm going to chill and I'm going to do other things. I'm going to master other things. But I'll never run away. I think people, they get a taste of the, the, other, the other cities and uh, they really fall in love with it and uh, they fall off their grind. And uh, they really lose their craft. Because they played Blake on the radio one time and he's gone. AJ Hearns made one good song. Crazy. King Kylie reps the shit out of San Antonio so hard you can't get them played in anywhere else. They're not gonna be jamming a song about San Antonio in Houston. They're not gonna shout us out. The rappers come over here and they make so much money. Kirkle Banks comes over here 10 times a year. If he needs to pay his phone bill, he comes here. That's what he does. Cause he can, cause we love him. Cause we don't love anybody here. We don't love anybody. Nobody's truly loved, and that's fucked up. But somebody needs to work for that love, and that somebody's gonna be me at the end of the fucking day. I hope y'all fuck with me.